Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to today's episode on the second channel here looking for something incredibly special, very new, and very fun. Something that I've never done before, card hunting for a brand new mystery box that is here in the Pokemon TCG world exclusively at Walgreens. Now apparently this mystery box has a 1 in 5 chance of giving a vintage base set pack. Yes, it's true, you could potentially find yourself a base set unlimited pack inside of these boxes. Again, a one in five chance. So today, we're gonna go out, we're gonna hit up some local Walgreens, we're gonna see if we can find some of these packs, and if we can, we're gonna open them live on the Twitch channel today. So make sure you're following on the Twitch channel, and let me know in the comments if you have been able to find these mystery boxes, um, and what you got from them. Now, we're gonna go out, we're gonna search, we're gonna hopefully find some, fingers crossed. Let's get Jake's watching bears. <laughs> What's going on in here? What's the vibe? Jake won't stop watching bears. Wow. And after our sprint to like four different Walgreens here in Los Angeles, the only thing that we came back with is one single pack of Darkness Ablaze. Listen, I'm still trying to complete the Darkness, Darkness Ablaze Master Set. I have not pulled, I mean, I haven't pulled the Charizard. I have not pulled really any of the super great ones from Darkness Ablaze. The only thing I pulled that was really cool was this one. Well, I guess I guess two really good ones, and then we, I mean, have a bunch of cards, but like, we have the uh, Secret Rare Turbo Patch, which was amazing, uh, and then the Aeternitus VMAX. Now, this one was really cool, but those are really the only good ones I've got from Darkness of Blaze so far. So, I've got a lot more to open. So, I, you know, I needed this, I did, but like, no m uh, magic, what is it called? Mystery boxes, no mystery boxes. Um, now, I'm gonna call around some Walgreens to see if I could find them somewhere in Los Angeles. One of the Walgreens ladies was saying that um, it was like in Los, I'm not like in the city, downtown Los Angeles, but like the Walgreens in the Los Angeles area might have it. And uh, I got some I got some dates on when certain stores restock and at what time they restock. So we'll try again this week to try to find those mystery boxes, but it's, it's not looking like they exist right now, you know, or they bought, they were bought out. But uh, it sounded like some of the Walgreens were saying that they did not even get them yet uh, and they were not set to get them and not all Walgreens will get them. Um, and not all greens have got all, not all Walgreens have gotten them. So it's not like they you know they're they're all sold out everywhere. It's it's more of like a supply thing of like they were never given the packs to begin with. So we'll see if we can get some. I would love to open this week. Uh, I would love. We'll see if we can get. Oh my God! My talking today is tough. That's why I've got coffee. We'll see if we can get our hands on some this week because uh, I love to open that on the live streams and then obviously for the channel. Let me know in the comments if you've found yourself some mystery boxes uh, with some uh, base set cards, man, it's super cool. The fact that you can get vintage base set packs out of this is uh, its a really cool thing. And obviously I've never opened vintage base set packs ever in my life, so this would be cool to find. We're gonna keep an eye out this week. We're gonna see what we do. Stay tuned on the channel, uh, but know that yes, that they are out there, but your local Walgreens might or might not have one. Uh, and, and I'd ask them about that. And I'd also ask what time they restock their shelves and what days the trucks come in, because that's information that's very useful to know. So that's what happened with my little adventure today. Now what we're gonna do is uh, obviously I'm gonna do a live stream right now and I'm sure we're gonna have some fun pull moments from that. Um, so please enjoy, hopefully, we're gonna be opening up some Champion's Path today, I think. I've got more Darkness of Blaze and Hidden Fates that come in this week, but Champion's Path, let's get to it. Make sure to leave a like and subscribe. Hopefully, we'll pull something good today.
we're starting with this. One single Darkness Ablaze pack that I got randomly in a Walgreens today looking for these new these new boxes that they have, okay? The addiction's rising. So I, I've never I've never bought a single pack like this before. So okay, the one and only the single pack that we got. Let's make sure this pack is like legit, you know what I'm saying? The single Darkness Ablaze pack that we got is a Centra Scorch. And we're gonna be opening this opening this up right now. So this is the first pack of the stream. Oh my god. Let's see. You think we could skin this today? Can you even skin these ones? I don't even know if you could skin the Darkness Ablaze ones. Oh, you can. Let's see if we can get a little skin going, huh? Do we skin this one? Do we skin this one? If I can, we're gonna do it. Okay, we're not skinning it. Alright, you know what? It's alright. It's good. Okay, so. This is the first pack opening of the day. There's definitely still some cards. Oh, this thing looks like kind of scuffed up. There's definitely still some cards uh, from Darkness Blaze. I'll actually a lot. I was I just finally got a binder. So even though we're not going to get anything super crazy rare out of this, um, we might get something that I need towards the completion. So let me get some luck in chat, ladies and gentlemen. Let's get it going, man. Lunatone. Hey, some struggle gloves. We better throw some hands today, huh? We better throw some hands today. Toxel, I love you. I literally love Toxel. A little Sinistee action. Sinistee's very cool, man. Got a blast. Meltan, my man. Marini and reverse hollow hoopa. Actually, I actually think I need this one right here. I think I have a hollow hoopa, but not the reverse hollow, so that's good. And then Gothitelli. Gotta say it like you're an Italian. Alright, I'm gonna save this little this little hoopa card because again I might need that for the collection. It's my first time ever opening this bad boy. So I mean I Nice, I pulled, I pulled my Zard from a pin box. That's why a lot of people have been pulling Zards from pin boxes. I've never opened a pin box before. I saw, again, I saw Enlisted Leaf Ando do his Zard from the pin box. We've opened 219 packs here in the TCG world and have never, ever gotten ourselves a Charizard. No Charizards ever. We still have quite a bit of Champion's Path that I actually have yet to complete too, so here we go. Ooh, I'm excited, I'm really excited for this. I'm actually really excited to hop into these guys. They def can be repackaged, but it's not likely. They are def fake. <laughs> Oh, I caught it. I caught it. Here is the promo card. A little bit curved here. What the heck happened to this guy, huh? Look at that. Jeez Louise, man, this poor card. But we've got, obviously, the promo hollow Dredna, which is very cool. Let me get some Dredna. Just abuse the box, me? Happens sometimes, yeah, right? All right, chat. This is gonna be the first Champion's Path pack of the night. One, two, three, four. Yeah. Right? Oh, Psychic. Should I start? I might start guessing the energy, man. Listen, I, you know, Leon Hart, obviously, I will always give hats off to Leon Hart, because that's his thing. But it's kind of a, it seems fun, man. I watch a lot of Leon Hart videos. Let me get some luck in the house right now. Let's get it going. Underway. We are now underway in the first pin box pack opening. Hatrem, Road on Foam. Road on Foam, can you call it the shiny luck, buddy? Turfield Stadium, full heel. Fantastic. Purloin, less fantastic. Little Kakuna. It wouldn't be a pack opening without a Trubbish. This guy, unluckily, brings the luck. For so, for whatever reason, the Trubbish brings the luck. I, I, I hate this thing so much. Little Hatena. All right, and Reverse Hollow Potion. And ladies and gentlemen, the first big one of the day is... Altaria, a little Hollow Altaria card. Okay, okay, not horrible. Fire Energy? Man, it's rough. All right, chat, let's get it going. Let me get the luck in chat. And you see Max Luck Hype, little B drill action, hopping in this Hatrem. Milo, this is the second pack from their first ever pin box opening. Again, the pull rates apparently are really juicy out of these. Let's go. All right, chat. That just means that we got some juicy luck coming in. We got Kabu. And this is the second one. It's going to be Obstagoon Holographic. All right. All right. This is pack number 222, which means it's got to be lucky. It's a Dreadnought pack, and I am King Dreadnought. I'm feeling something juicy in here. Ladies and gentlemen, let me get some, let me get your max amount of luck you possibly can give in chat. Fighting type energy to start off. Obstagoon in the Obstagoon pack. Imagine Team Yell Grunt, Bead, hoping for something good here. Again, the pull rates apparently are good. This is pack number 222, which means it's gotta be a lucky pack. Thank you to Matthew for joining the stream extra late. You sleep in today, buddy. Let's go. <laughs> good to see you, my friend. All right, all right. Okay, little reverse hollow. Okay, that's always a good sign, my boy. Okay, and underneath MK on pack number 222 is uh, it's another Altaria. All right, the next box is going up. Oh my god. Well, the cards have been bad. Okay, yeah, this is uh, you know, let's uh, let's start out. Let's let's go cream obstagoon cream. Okay, that's the that's the direction which this uh, this this opening will flow. The packs be moisty tonight for sure. Yeah. <laughs> Not the, not the more, Obstagoon last? Okay, maybe we do Obstagoon last, eh? We're gonna cream sandwich him. Pause. 
little psychic energy, telling me that this will be juicy, all right? And I'm a psychic type. Look, see, psychic followed by psychic, all right? I promise. This one is going to be juicy. We're all going to go crazy after I pull what is the best card in the pack, the VMAX Charizard, out of this little grab right here. Says out bed. All right, remember, these are all warm-ups. See, look, Volpix, all right? We started off with a psychic because I could see in the future and this one's gonna be lit. Volpix because whatever's under this is gonna be fire. And Scrafty because I'm a dirty liar and we are not pulling anything good at the moment. 100 subs says I'm gonna pull a hollow first edition Charizard out of this pack right here. I'm joking, that's a joke. Uh, that, that was not signed in ink and we never shook hands on that, so I cannot be chased in the streets or in a court of law. All right, Hatterim, suspicious food to eight. How? Every time we, we pull a suspicious food tin, I need a little sus check on how suspicious this food tin is. Because we know it's sus, but like, how sus is it, you know? That's the important question. Malamar. Okay. This is bed. Purloin. Is that reverse hollow? That's not. Okay, that's okay. Reverse chat. Now, how sus is that? That one's pretty sus. 38% sus. How about this one? This one seems a little bit more sus than 38%. I'm going to be honest with you. This one seems a wee bit more sus. Okay, well, if this is 71% sus, then, I mean, what is it hiding? Yeah, this one is pretty sus, huh? With Hatterene behind that? Yeah. That is, that is definitely sus. Can't look in sus. One, two, three, four. Yeah, let's get some warm up in chat. We so far have not pulled anything juicy yet. Fire energy. You know why? Because this one's about to be a fire pack. It's about to be fire. Karana. I love you, Swablu. Volpix, please bring the fire. Come on now. Trubbish. I'm going to sacrifice you, Trubbish. Don't take it personally. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Um. It must be done. All right, all right, it had to be done. Reverse hollow electric energy. And ladies and gentlemen, after the Trubbish sacrifice, this is a creamy VMAX, it worked, it worked. Al Creamy VMAX, the first rare pull of the night. <laughs> How did that work? Oh my God. Oh, it worked. <laughs> All right, let it be known, no Trubbish survives this point out. No Trubbish survives this point on. Pack 229 without a Charizard. Don't let it come in too hot. All right, let's get it going. Pack number 229, we got freaking Pierce to Team Yell Grunt to hop. Is this rigged or what? What's going on here? The next pack will be hot, spicy tamale. Hot, the spicy tamale, huh? This is the hot, the spicy tamale pack. A really cool, yes, a nicket, yes. Milo, bringing out the big biceps so we can carry in whatever's underneath him. Scrafty. Oh my God. A little electric, it's electrifying, it's zappy. Okay, Lipard, get him out of here. Get him out of here. Pokemon Center Lady, you do not want that food tin, trust me. You stay away from that, all right? I'm looking out for you. Swablu, okay. That's lit, okay. Zygarde. I mean, it's not horrible, you know? Like, like all my homies love Zygarde, but. I'd rather not, please. All right, y'all. Electrifying, it's an electrifying pack. Team Yell Grunt, don't yell at me, Bead. You stay with, Bead, Bead is just, you know, something. Sharpedo, a lot of dark cards in here. Scrafty, Scraggy, Ekans, Kakuna, Nick. Hello, Nick, how you doing, Swablu? All right, reverse hollow energy. This is always a good sign. Can I get some rainbow rare luck in the house right now? Fiery, it's the bad juicy, Marty. Next box coming in hot right here, okay? Let me get your luck in chat, chat. I mean, if, listen, if, if freaking, if, if Enlisted Leaf wants to do a little collab where we do like, what, what is it called? Like square up or tear up? Like either, either you tear your card or you punch the other person in the face. You know, if he wants to do one of those collabs, man, I'm down, but that's his thing, you know? Square up or tear up. Either you tear your card or get punched in the face. So you kind of take an L either way. All right. Oh, rip it or flip it. Okay, not tear up or square up. Got it. Hatena. Okay. And listen, chat. The sacrifice strat is a strat worth trying. Because after the hollow swablu is a dreadnought V. It worked again. Mm, I'm gonna eat every bag of trash I can find on the street from now on for life luck. Let's go. Why does this work? Full art Dreadnought V card right there. Very nice. I am King Dreadnought chat. I am known as King Dreadnought in these streets. You know what I'm saying? So better watch out. This is gonna be a little Obstagoon action. Maybe maybe we can do some, you know, Obstagoon luck, right? A little Obstagoon luck. All right. Hey, hey, fire energy because it's gonna be a fire pack, all right? Let me get your luck in the house right now. I need, I need it. I need, I need max luck. Max luck. Hello, Piers. 
Let me get some rainbow rare emotes in the chat. Pokeball, I'm gonna catch them all, and by them all, I mean all of you. I'm gonna captivate your hearts with this Pokeball. Carvana, Zigzagoon, chat. Oh no. <laughs> it's a reverse hollow trumpet. <laughs> I'm not gonna eat him. I'm not gonna eat him, okay? Oh, cause it's reverse hollow. And underneath him, oh, it's another Dreadnought V. <laughs> it's another Dreadnought V. Oh my God. That's two in a row, two in a row. Two full our Dreadnought V in a row. Oh my God. No, we're gonna keep him alive, okay? Look, see, we spared him and he gave us a little luck, huh? What, see, the, the cards earlier, they were just warm-up cards, baby. They were just warm-up cards, baby. Dreadnought V. Okay. We will probably one, two, three, four, do at least one more pack opening session tonight, a little bit later on in the stream. And we still have three, we still have three more pin boxes to open, um, which is 12 more cards. So we'll see. So far, nothing insanely rare out of these pin collection boxes. Um, okay, although I, again, I know that these have good pull rates. Apparently, I've seen some people pull some really cool stuff uh, and heard of some people pulling some really cool stuff. So I'm hoping that we can be one of those people. Let me get some luck in chat for the last pull. Some last pull luck here. Okay, we got we have a freaking reverse hollow energy card. Usually the big cards hide behind these cards because they feel more confident behind them because it's a cool card. They're like, you know what? I'm cool, so I want to hide behind someone cool. So, ladies and gentlemen, the last one of the night. The last one of the night. The last one of the night is a Waylord V, which actually is a very good card. I will take a Waylord V. We pulled quite a bit of these guys, so, uh, you know, this is kind of another repeat for my collection, but the first time pulling it tonight, and I know that Waylord V actually is a pretty good card out of the Champion's Path collection, so not a horrible pull at all. Not horrible, even a little bit. I'm down. Last pack luck, ending with a Waylord V. Again, we got more packs we're going to be opening tonight, so, yeah. Yeah.